Stephen Dimmick here at Film Festival Flix for Teed Off with Chuck Sakula, who is in Teed Off, the short film we have tonight. So welcome, Chuck. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Now, we were actually just talking before the cameras were rolling, and we would, I want you to kind of go over a little bit what you were saying about, we were talking about the, we were talking about, um, not where we were born. Not no. where we, no, we weren't talking about where we were Inside born. Joke. Inside joke. <laughs> Um, well, I was saying, uh, we felt, I shot this film, uh, we probably shot about five years ago in New York, and I lived in New York for, for 12 years, and I just recently moved back to Los Angeles. This is my second year here. And it's, it's quite fascinating that it's been five years, and it's been getting all this recognition. Uh, it's doing very well in the festivals, and it's, it's exciting to see. I haven't seen Chris in five years since we shot it, and uh, we only speak on, on Facebook really. Um, so it's exciting to see where this has landed and what he's done by himself, basically, on a dime, uh, on pennies, for pennies. And I think that's one of the great things about Film Festival Flicks is it's the whole new medium of how to see films online, how to see independent films, how to see short films, how to bring all of this together, because before Film Festival Flicks, there wasn't really a way that it could reach such a big audience, which I think is really phenomenal, especially for producers, for actors, for writers, for all of that kind of stuff. So uh, what does that kind of mean to you to be able to get this kind of exposure now? Well, you know, it, it, being in this business as an actor, everyone wants to achieve, you know, the, the diamond, the, the, the carrots, and have the big houses and the nice cars. And they, um, but. In this, in this day and age, it's very hard. It's very hard to be seen unless you already have a name. So everything is about doing things for yourself, mm. writing your own shows, web series, anything that you can get. Every, social media is everywhere. You know, so it's about getting your name out there, getting that fire on your name so people will want to see you. They want to see you more. And for me, all I want to do is work. I want to do is, is do good work. I want to be on TV. I don't need to be a celebrity, but in order to get my name out there, I have to do, I have to do these little indie films, and thank God for uh, short film competitions and these short films because they are out there, yeah. and you do get a fire behind it. And same with when you're writing a project, when you're directing a project, it's all very extremely important because you don't know where these comp these films end up. You know, like I said, we shot this five years ago, right. and this is still running uh, and still making the, the headlines. And I'm I'm ecstatic to be here and to see where see where it goes. I know because it's it's going on tour now. It's going on tour. There's about 14, 15 more cities it goes to. So I'm I'm fortunate. And who would have thought five years ago, um, for pennies, <laughs> for pennies, uh, filming this on the on the bank of an East River, and we had a good time, uh, a great time. I remember. It was, and it's fun. Chris is from an acting. She and I went to the same yeah. acting studio. Uh, MTB, hi Mary Boyer, uh, and, and Giordano, who's also arranging. Oh, yes. Yeah, she's she's involved along with it too. So it's good people and good things coming out of MTB. Thank you, Mary. <laughs> <laughs> so tell me, Chuck, what have you got coming up now? What's your next? What's the next thing you kind of got well, the poker I, I in? Just, I just finished two other short films. One is called Aunt Lena. Uh, uh, it's about. What is it about? It is about things are not always what they appear to be. Uh, directed by Jay Levy. Hopefully we'll be out a couple months. And another one was called um, It's Your Turn. And another twist of events, a comedy, uh, directed or written by Doug Dangerfield, directed by Tom Pardo, hoping to make the film festivals. And uh, I just booked a Fidelity commercial yesterday. So, <laughs> <laughs> so I'm happy. Uh, and then, you know, the process goes on. I just continue to audition. Um, but that's good so far. And I have the holidays. Got to go home and see mom in Chicago. Hi, mom. Hi, you mom. must be proud. <laughs> she is. She is. She, she's hung in there and she's supported me along the way. And tell me, if you had, if there was a group of teenage kids out there watching, saying, how do I get to actually work in the craft? What, do, what, is, what would be the number one tip that you could give them? Um, number one tip, perseverance, confidence. Be open to everything. Uh, listen to what people are telling you, critique-wise, and just open your mind and and educate yourself with everything that's out there, because you just can't rely on one 
medium. You know, you have to lo- know everything and and read the papers. Be be uh, abre- on top of, of everything because it uh, it falls into play. Uh, but just be open. Don't give up. You know, I, I'll say it's 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 not easy. It's mm. not an easy life. But if you love it, then you stick with it, and you will and persevere, and you're gonna reap the rewards. And you'll love it when they're high, when they're high, when they're low, they're low. But that's why I love it. It's part of the ride. So just hang in there. Confidence.